Hello, I am Carlos Asmat, and I'm going to show you a little bit about uh, a behavior I did to link now to the Wolfram Alpha Knowledge Engine. So basically, now uh, now can answer pretty much any question you can have. So that that's very really useful uh, around the house uh, to answer any question you uh, you can sort of have randomly. Uh, we we can demo a bunch of questions that are normally useful for, for normal people. So let's get started. So basically you touch the head, it will uh, it will use uh, the Google um, speech to text engine and then it will it will uh, fetch the answer from Wolfram Alpha. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? That should be fairly useful. So it's fetching the answer. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? A woodchuck would chuck all the wood he could chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood. According to the tongue twister, although the paper the ability of woodchucks could chuck cellulose fibers by P. A. Hoskevich and P. B. Shane Annals of Improbable Research Volume. 1. No. 4. Pages. 4 9. July August 1995. Concluded that the woodchuck can chuck 361. 9,237,001 cubic centimeters of wood per day. Closing parenthesis. Alright, that was a bit long. Uh, also, the behavior is rather experimental, so there might be some wrong things there. Who are you gonna call? Who are you gonna call? Ghostbusters. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. According to the theme song from the 1984 film Ghostbusters performed by Ray Parker Jr. Closing parenthesis. What's the answer to life, the universe, and everything? Answer to the ultimate question of life, the universe, and everything. 42. According to Douglas Adams' humorous science fiction novel, The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Alright. Are you Skynet? Are you Skynet? No, Skynet became self-aware on August 29, 1997 at 02.14 a.m. U.S. Eastern Daylight Time. I, on the other hand, was not switched on until May 15, 2009. Furthermore, unlike Skynet, I enjoy interacting with humans in ways that do not involve the launching of nuclear missiles. According to Sarah Connor and the P-800 in the 1991 science fiction film Terminator 2, Judgment Day, Skynet became self-aware and initiated a nuclear attack against Russia on the above date to provoke a counterattack and nuclear holocaust. Closing parenthesis. Square root of 2. SQRP21. 414 to 1, 3, 5, 6, 2, 3, 7, 3, 0, 9, 5, 0, 4, 8, 8, 0, 9, 5, 0, 1, 6, 8, 8, 7, 2, 4, 2, 0, 9, 6, 9, 8, 0, 7, 8, 5, 6, 9, 6, 7, 1, 8, 7, 5, 3, 7, 6, 9, 4, 8, 0, dot, dot. All right. Who let the dogs out? Who let the dogs out? What does the scouter say about his power level? What does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000. According to the memo originating from the Adam Dragon Ball Z, in which characters use scouters to detect power levels. 
Why did the chicken cross the road? Why did the chicken cross the road? To get to the other side. Ha, ha. What came first? The chicken or the egg? Which came first, the chicken or the egg? There could not have been a first egg to give a beginning to birds. Or there should have been the first bird which gave a beginning to eggs. For a bird comes from an egg. According to Aristotle's commentary on this question when taken as a classic metaphor of circular cause and consequence. I know Kung Fu. I know Kung Fu. Show me. According to Neo and Morpheus in the 1999 science fiction action film The Matrix. Who framed Roger Rabbit? Who framed Roger Rabbit? Judge Doom. According to the 1988 fantasy comedy film Who Framed Roger Rabbit? What is your favorite color? What is your favorite color? Blue. No yell dash o. Asked by the bridge keeper and incorrectly answered by Sir Galahad in the 1975 film Monty Python and the Holy Grail. What is your quest? What is your quest? To do computation for the world. Although King Arthur's answer in Monty Python's The Holy Grail is, I seek the Holy Grail. Honey Badger don't care? Honey Badger don't care. It just takes what it wants, according to the internet. Who is Bruce Wayne? Batman, fictional character. Batman is the fictional Gotham City superhero whose real identity is the billionaire industrialist and playboy Bruce Wayne, according to DC Comics. Can you open the shuttle bay doors, Hal? Who shot the sheriff? shot the sheriff. I shot the sheriff. But I didn't shoot no deputy. Oh no. Oh. According to the Bob Marley song, made even more famous by Eric Clapton's well-known cover. Closing parenthesis. Are you a robot? Are you? Dot. Dot. Question mark. I am a collection of computers. Do you want to take over the world? Do you want to take over the world? No, just to make it more computable. <laughs>